Hello there, lumpies and germs. I'm forgetting to say that at the start of all these episodes, but now I, I'm not actually sure when the episodes start and when they stop as I'm recording, so I'm going to start remembering to do it just as we do each session. Anyway, hello, lumpies and germs. Welcome back to my playthrough of Cash Banuka 1. No subtitle, because it's the first one. We are now on Slippery Climb, but seeing as though we did um, Stormy Ascent earlier... Well, actually, at the very beginning of this playthrough, this is going to be much easier to deal with, I'm pretty sure. On the original game, this place is a nightmare, so I can't imagine what um, a Stormy Ascent would have been like on the original game if it was included, which it wasn't, but it's in this one. We're coming up to 99 lives, because Crash has got 99 problems and the lives ain't one. Do you think they ever accidentally, like, reached their hands over to each other and they, and they realised that... They're not alone. In case anybody's interested, um, I have come back into this recording session as Simon Sweat once again, because I've just been um, um, having a little bit of a drum before this session has started. So I am perfectly energized and also very, very damp. Ready for... No, I'm not ready. I'm dead. I didn't even have a checkpoint there. I think this is a level where you can't die. I'm, I'm going to quit just in case it is. It is a coloured gem stage, so it's a good thing I decided to quit because I would have missed that gem if I decided to die. Because that's how these games work. You decide to die. That wasn't, that wasn't an accident. I, d I chose to die then because I wanted to check if, indeed, it was a coloured gem route. That was entirely my choice. Because as you all know, I'm the Banuka Bingo Boy. I need to focus more on the game and less about what I'm saying into this microphone. Because I still haven't got quite, I haven't quite got the hang of doing both at the same time. That's why I haven't got a face cam, because I don't want to be concentrating on what my face is doing while I'm looking at that face. Let's just do, do one thing at a time. Slow down, shut up, leave me alone, mum. Oh, dude, I just realised they've got f four fingers. Uh -huh! Do you know what? I've never actually seen them do that before. I've always just kind of spun them, and I've never seen them do that animation before. That's awful. Who are they, and why are they in this... I, I'm assuming this is Cortex's castle. What are they doing in there? I think Cortex has got some dirty secrets he needs to tell everybody about. Because if he likes to make slaves and minions out of I'm dead, I'm gonna quit. Slaves and minions out of animals, then God knows what he's doing to the old men. How long have they been there? Does he like old men in particular? Or does he keep young boys and wait until they get nice and crusty? I don't know. What does he do with them after that? Does he dispose of them? Does he let them die? Does he feed them? Does he use them as pets? If the if the animals are his minions and his slaves, are the old people his pets? I suppose we can ponder that as long as we want, because we um, have to start the level again <laughs> since I died. I, I think I've died more here than I did on Stormy Set. No, I didn't. No, I don't think I did. That's a harder level. Yeah, we, we can ponder more about the old men hiding in the grates, uh, seeing as though we are going to be coming up to them again because I can't get enough of old men in metal bars. And here we go again. Maybe they just dropped something. That is, that's the, that's, those are the fingers of someone that's dropped something. Oh, I, I did I put it? It's kind of embarrassing that I've died so many times already. I haven't even got to the second level of the castle yet. This is all the first level of the castle. Right, I need to figure out what the timing of this is. That's it. Ah, do, 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 no! I suppose the good thing is, is that it's not actually that bad that I keep having to restart the level because I haven't reached the first checkpoint anyway, so I can't, like, I just start at the beginning of the level anyway, so I might as well just quit and make sure that I get the colour gem. Although, saying that, do you get the colour gem if you die after the first, like, before the first checkpoint? Because if you do, I'm wasting valuable seconds of the amazing PC load times of this game, trying to figure that one out. Get away, Grandad. It's much easier to do, like, those window platformy bits, because in the original game, Crash is so dopey. He's a lumpy, plumpy, dumpy head in that game, and he he's impossible to control with his, like, floaty, heavy weight. So when you're trying to do those bits, it's practically impossible um, to do it without major luck. But now it's much easier, because the controls in this game are tight. Okay, I'm not going to go for that one. I'm going to wait. You watch me wait. This is a game of patience. I would say like Mastermind, but as I re-remembered, that's not how Mastermind works. Oh my god, we have not got this far before. Yes, we did. This is where I died. Okay, no. Now, 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 now. Yes! 
Yes! Okay. No, that's not going to do it. This is going to do it. Is there anything in here? Nope. Okay, well, I came into this um, recording being Simon Sweat, and I'm now... Yeah, well, I started this recording off um, being Simon Sweat indeed, but at this point I'm now Samuel Sweatier. Because this is really tense. Don't you dare throw your Pepto-Bismol. Do you have Cowpole in the States? Anyone in the UK? Do you remember Cowpole? That shit was the tits. I would, I would drink that. I would, like, guzzle it down like water. That was my sustenance when I was younger. Calpol was the absolute best. But that's what he's throwing. That's why he's at, that's why he's evil. He's wasting all the Calpol that can go to a good home. Okay, whereabouts are we? 24 out of 51 boxes. Okay, we're, we're doing okay. Oh, great. It's another baby stage. Let's do it. We're in. Now, as we discovered, I think we can die um, on these stages and still get the gem. So, let's just hope... Jesus, Jesus Christ! Okay, no. Okay, I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but I cheated the game and I think I did all right. Okay, let's go. No, I don't. I think I was supposed to jump from the TNT there. I'm. I can't remember honestly. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. <laughs> okay, here we go again. Goodness. Gideon crash! This is way more frustrating than it has any right to be. Okay. I'm not gonna bother with these lives. I don't need the lives. Let's be real here. Uh, well, I apparently I do. God damn! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> did you see that? Keras, epic replay that moment there. That was incredible. Come on, baby! No, no. The embryo disappeared once again. And I'm not going to make that joke because you're all going to do it for me. I don't want to get demonetized. I have a family to feed. No, you're kidding! I was so busy thinking about Brio's head being in places it shouldn't that I died. Oh, this is embarrassing. This is absolutely embarrassing. The, the run was going so well. Problem is, I'm just doing the same stuff all over again, so I don't know what I can really say about any of it. I mean, it's it's a wall. It's wet. And why is it wet? Because that's rain. And where does rain come from? My ass. Off we go. Down we go. Off we go. And on we go. Here they are again. Our two best Johnny friends there. Now that because I've done all of this stuff again, I can't actually say anything else new. So wh while I'm here, in case anyone was wondering, um, the editor for the series is, in, is, is, of course, Keris. She wrote her name in the first episode, but it's Welsh and it's stupid. And I don't think many people know how to pronounce it. So it's Keris, not Cerise or Clarice, like Dr. Lecter, like she's had jokes about her entire life. It's Keris. Um... Sorry, did I say it was dumb? No, Welsh is lovely. I'm sorry, honey. I didn't mean that. But yeah, so Karis is my... My long love girlfriend. Long love? What the hell am I talking about? I'm concentrating too much. Are you kidding me, you f***ing orange stain? See, that's, that's what happens. When you think too much about your honey, that's what happens. You fall down bloody holes in Crash Bandicoot. Well, you're supposed to be being very good for the game, for the children watching your show on YouTube. You're so busy, wound up thinking about your bloody partner. So yeah, that anyway, that's where that's where I was. Yeah, so Karis is lovely. She edits the show. She does a very good job. She's very sweet, and her text bubbles never fail to make me laugh. At least they never fail to make me laugh as much as I fail at this particular level. I I don't know why I'm struggling so much. I think, I think I'm overthinking too much. I must have sweated out all of my brain juices when I was drumming earlier. I don't. I really don't know, but I did. I actually know now I didn't die this much on... Well, no, I didn't die. No, 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 no. Stormy, Stormy Ascent doesn't have a colour gem. Yeah, no, I didn't die this much on Stormy Ascent. I'm pretty sure I didn't. But maybe the fact that I know that you have to get through this whole level without dying to get the coloured gem... It's kind of putting more pressure on me, I guess. I'm, I'm not sure, but we'll, we'll do it. You watch. Because, because my Let's Play channel is about journeys, not the bands. 
because I don't like the band journey. Oh my... And that's what happens when I think about the band Journey and their shitty song, Don't Stop Believing. Oh yeah, and by the way, in case anyone was, was wondering, yes, Keris is sitting right next to me right now. She's loving every second of this shit. She's loving it. She's trying not to laugh. She's holding back her tears in laughter because if she laughs, she'll ruin the recording. But I don't know how much you could ruin the, reco the recorder. <laughs> You can't ruin the recorder, that's the best instrument in the world. You can't ruin the recording of this play any more than the way I'm doing it right now. This is dreadful, I'm so sorry everybody. I'll get better, I promise I'll get better. Maybe I should shut up for a bit. Karis, I'll show you how to do this. She hasn't, she hasn't quite learnt all of Vegas yet, so I'm gonna have to teach her like, like a teacher in, in a school and give her detention. So, I get, in detention, Karis, you are going to speed up this entire bit of footage until I got to after the Brio bonus stage when I died the, the, the last time. <laughs> Right, where were we? Keris just high wand my elbow. High wand in our language is um, basically using your index finger as a high five. That's a high wand. This is where I die now, isn't it? Oh geez, this is this. I'm really sweating now. <sighs> okay. I also just realised as I was going through there, and I had all the time in the world to ponder and look at every single individual aspect of this stage. There's no Aku Aku crates or anything, so it's really really mean when you think about it. But I think I just did it, so it's okay. I got the red gem. I nearly jumped into the portal at the end without picking the red gem up. Oh my god. Thanks, Crash. Throw it up. Good boy. And now we're on to Lights Out. Another coloured gem stage, and I think it has a key because there's a bonus above me. Oh, this one's not too bad. I could do this one quickly. Oh, Jaws of Darkness is the one with the secret ending. Okay. I could do this really quickly. We've got like three minutes left or so on this recording session today, so you watch me go. Let's go. This is definitely music built for running around in the dark. This is the music that goes through in my head when I'm like naked running through the house for a glass of water. Oh no. I've messed this up already because I've already hit the Aku Aku, which means I'm going to go dark and I need to get the colour gem. So I'm not going to do it, guys. I'm really sorry. I tried. I really did. I'm sorry I disappointed. No, I did it. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. What's hiding in the dark? That's the next question. Who knows what's hiding in the dark? It could be something that makes your pants seep. Oh, look. Red eyes. Oh, they make my pants seep. <laughs> Look at the, look at the, look at, yeah, yeah, I mean, they're scary, guys. They're really scary. That is a pants seeping moment in gaming right there. Top 10 pants seeps in games. That's my next video, everybody. Okay. No. Oh, jeez, I thought that was going to get really, I thought that was going to stop further away. I lost Aku Aku. Sh Can I do this? <laughs> I'm convinced I was really close to the end there, so just give me a s gosh darn second. I will do this. It's not that long of a stage. I can do this. It's fine. Shut up, mum. Again, I told you. I'm a big boy now. I don't need the lasagna tonight. Okay, let's go again, shall we? Up the RV, over the, over the gap, over the gap. Not the shop, not with the clothes. I can't jump over a gap. Cause I'm a man And the shop's too high For a man to jump over Do you like my singing? I've got an album coming out soon It's called Caddy's Voice is Nails and Other Stories Na Nails Nails in your eardrums You can't tell me you can't think of this music when you're like tiptoeing down the stairs and all, the, all your like naked bits flopping around. It's, it's it's perfect music for that kind of image, isn't it? Well, there's Karis again, trying not to laugh. I need to I need to stop making I need to stop making observations like this because it's it's not helping the recording. We are going to jeopardize the quality of this show if I can't make my editor shut up for a second. Well, what noise was that? What was that? Oh no, it was oh right, it was the axes. I think. I'm not actually, and after all that, I needed a colored gem. You can piss right off, game. 
piss off with your pants, Seep. So I can't get the box gem anyway. Don't worry, I need the I need the green gem, so I'm just gonna keep going until the end of this level. Now the next question is, how is it so dark in here when there's um when there's candles everywhere? That's the next question. <laughs> like Temple Ruins has less lighting and yet more light. The, the, Cortex hasn't thought about any of this. Oh, yeah, screw you two. Fuff. Yes, Crash is fuffing once again. Great, but you didn't do anything.